Hello friends, it's me, Debbie. And today I have got a couple packages. Went to Dollar Tree the other day, me and hubby. So I have a Dollar Tree haul. And I think I have enough stuff to do a full face, which will be the video after this. And I also have an Ulta haul with um, a gift card that hubby got for me. Well, some of the gift card. Now, if you guys you hear some stuff going on in the background, you know it's real life here. I'm in the kitchen today. Um, hubby's making some vegetable beef soup, some homemade vegetable beef soup, so you might hear some stuff going on. So, it's gonna be some good stuff. But, but first off, I wanna show what's in the giveaway for he's making soup. <laughs> Yeah, that's the guy that's gonna get the pie on February 14th. Yeah, what a way to say I love you. But for, <laughs> he's not that busy. Some of them are just frozen vegetables, but it is homemade. Okay, now for my giveaway for my January collab and my birthday, um, which ends on February 7th, which is Tuesday, and then I will pick the winner on February 9th. You're going to get this cute little bag. And along with that, you're going to get, since it was my birthday, you're going to get this little wristlet I found. And then you can put your little, put your ID in here and little cards. It's really nice. I just don't, I just don't use it. I mean, I wouldn't use it. So, got this. Then you have a nice little sheet mask, watermelon mint sheet mask. And you have a little lip mask. And we have a NYX palette. So that will be a giveaway that I will be doing on the 7th. So, so you have, a, well, we, I will pick the winner on the 9th, but you have until the 7th. Now for my hundredth subscriber and that will be done on the four I will pick the winner on the 14th after I throw the pie in his face which I can't wait I have a lip scrub a blue mascara and this is part of my Dollar Tree haul hyaluronic acid Love this stuff. A coach wristlet. This is brand new for this collab. Some beauty blenders. I've gotten these before and used them. Um, it's a little facial wipes. These are green tea and aloe. And I also got some cupcake scented desert dessert bronzer. So that is for my uh, collab for my well not my collab but for my hundred subscriber which I so, so dearly appreciate. I appreciate it so much. So, now we're gonna get into what I, else I got at the Dollar Tree. So I got some hand sanitizer. I got some pomegranate and vanilla. And I also got a cucumber melon. And these were all $1.25. 
Everything that I got was $1.25. And I got another, and this was, oh, and this is the by the brand. What does it say? But this is Ioni. This is the blue mascara. And this is some waterproof natural brow pencil. And it is in medium brown. I have used their pencils, their eyebrow pencils, and they are good. Um, I just needed a darker shade. I think I, I think I did get a darker one. And they really are waterproof, but they come off very easy with uh, um, a balm, makeup balm. And I did get some more hyaluronic acid. And if you have these, you can use these on your skin. On your skin, I use them on my like. Um, you know, if you get so many, I don't know if some of you have subscriptions and you get these in subscriptions, you get uh, sample sizes. You can use them on your skin, on your elbows, your feet, your arms, your legs. Yeah, you can use them on that. I use them on my face. I love hyaluronic acid, especially like under your eyes. I did have a great big bag underneath here this morning and it's still not all that great, but it's gone down quite a bit. Um, I have a lip stain, a macaron. Just says macaron lip stain, cruelty free. And this is by Beauty Into by Beauty Intuition in Into yeah, it's Beauty something, bi. And we got these Ioni lashes, which I really do like Ioni lashes. These a purple wispy. Dramatic flare. These look really pretty. I don't know which ones I'm going to use, but. And then we got the Ioni Lash Glue Liner, and this is in black. I'm going to try this. I have not used this, but I'm going to try it. And I also got. Ioni Blush. This is in Sophia. It's a pretty color. I haven't taken it out yet, but you can see the color. Probably should have taken everything out. Um, and this one is a, it's an eyebrow highlight. Like after you get done, you know, with your brows, you can take them, kind of clean them up. It helps a lot, you know, after you get done with, uh, either waxing, plucking, and there's redness, you can use it there, or just clean it up after you get done with your brow pencil or whatever you use. Now I found this, this is, I, and this is what I was looking for, is I wanted to find all the Essentially Ageless. Essentially Ageless is one of the brands for Dollar Tree. And I wanted to find all of that in the makeup. The only thing I could find was the foundation. And it, it is in medium deep, but I think I can, I think I can share it out. And if not, we can use powder and I will even try, this time I will use, you know, a concealer if needed to kind of fix it. But I am, somebody said that this is pretty good. I've seen someone do a review and they said that this is a decent con uh, foundation. So we're gonna try it, $1.25. And I found another dessert bronzer blush. And it is cookie scented. I'm gonna take this one out. Maybe, maybe take it out. Oh my gosh, I probably should have done all this beforehand. Okay. Oh, it is cookie scented, okay. 
and this is it the color um i don't see blood uh that's kind of like a glowy blush but yeah we'll see all this when i go to try it on and then this here is niacinamide which you know i love it my face loves it it's in little capsules so you can just get these break them and use it on your face. Niacinamide is good for your pores. It does not shrink them, but it does, uh, um, it helps unclogs your pores. So that way, if you, you know your pores are unclogged, it does kind of diminish it a little bit. It does not shrink, your pores do not shrink, but if they're unclogged, they do seem like, you know, they're shrunk, but they're not, you know, they're still open. Your pores do not close. Once they're open, they're open. And then here is another pair of lashes, and these are called Emma. Okay, and my earrings are called Lily. Now, if any of you that do not know, um, many, many years ago, before um, I had my youngest, um, I lost twins, and they were Emma and Lily. I lost them um, when I was six months pregnant. I went in and, you know, on a Friday, everything, you know, for a normal checkup, they said everything was fine, everything was normal, it was progressing along, and I already had them named, you know, Emma and Lily. And on Sunday, I started having contractions, and it was Mother's Day. And it was also my baby brother's birthday and um, I was dropped off at the hospital. I'm not going to go into anything other than this, but, um, and I, I had a miscarriage and lost both of my babies. So, uh, you know, Mother's Day is, I have mixed feelings on Mother's Day. I still do to this day. You know, it's 30 years, 30 plus years later and I still... You know, I still have this. So Emma and Lily, those two names are very, very special to me. Um, you know, I always, I know what each of them look like to this day. I celebrate their birthdays to this day. You know, I celebrate with my brother. They're, they're in heaven with my baby brother. They're, you know, with my mom, my grandparents, my dad. So my sister, they're just, but I do, I know what each of them look like to this day. They have, I know what each of them have looked like, but how they've aged throughout the years too. So it's just very special. And maybe someday I will go in here if somebody would like to know some of the story and they like would need help going through this too, I could um, go into this with them. I could, uh, take you on my little journey. But the one good thing after that, though, is, you know, a year later on Father's Day, I had my baby son. So, you know, it's kind of like a bittersweet. So I wouldn't have had him. But that's why I love the thing, Emma. So that's why I go through this. But I have my earrings that these were called Lily. And, you know, the lashes are Emma. And actually back here, it is red and green because my Emma has red hair. So, and this is some glitter liner and it's also Iona, Ioni, or is it Ioni? But they have, um, and this is gold, some gold glitter liner. So figure out how to use some of this. And I also got, this is LA Girl though. I haven't used LA Girl eyeshadows in a hot minute. But we got an eyeshadow palette that we're going to do too. And I also got some purple mascara. This is LA Girl. A mascara, 80s mascara, you know, is coming back. And I will be doing an 80s inspired look here soon too. Oh, and here is some wet and wild. Here is some silver eyeliner. 
some glitter eyeliner. And here is a contour stick. Or you can use this as you can use this as a contour stick, you can use it as an eyeshadow, you can use it for whatever. Multi stick. Love it. And here is a moisturizer, a Pons moisturizer, right? You can put this in your purse. You can use this on your hands, your legs, your feet, your face, whatever you want. I thought this was pretty nice. Little one. And this is, they said this is new. It's got vitamin E and glycerin. And then a pretty nail polish. I'm going to do this. It's got some little glitter in it. Green. So what I will be doing is I'm going to be doing a Valentine's Day look, but not, I mean, on Valentine's Day. Uh, I'm going to be doing a makeup look with all of my Dollar Tree stuff. And then, you know, next month is also you got Mardi Gras. Got to do some Mardi Gras stuff, girls. And we also have St. Patty's Day. So I got some St. Patty's Day looks. I got one I'm going to put up that I'd done a couple years ago that I think was probably one of my best ones. Probably one of my best looks I've done. But we're going to do a St. Patty's Day. Going to do some Mardi Gras. Going to do some Valentine. Going to do just, just some all out good looks. That's what we're going to do. Okay. Now that was... Dollar Tree. Now we're going to go in with my Alta. So, with Alta, I got me some, oh, and with my hair, I got it up. I don't have anything in it because I'm going to dye it probably tomorrow, so I don't have any products in it, and it's, you know, it's didn't wash it. I just kind of wet it and put it up, and so there. Um, I have got some Curl Talk scalp scrub got some of this gonna be trying this i've been using jvn um and that's been pretty good the shampoo and conditioner and the um air dry cream i do like that but we're going to do try this out we'll see what this is like and i got me a new sponge i'm sponge brush got me a new brush from real techniques the kitty paw for concealer or whatever you want to use it for i guess this one is just to look at because it doesn't want to come out yeah this is a looking at brush but I don't really use concealer or anything, but this, you know, you can get up through here with your foundation. Get in through here. Put on your uh, eye primer. Even just put on your foundation. I like that. This feels really soft. Timer's going off. Got some Curl Talk mousse. I haven't used this. I've been I wanting to try it because you know I got my curly hair. So you know, not your mother's. So I'm gonna try it. Uh, got some Hass Tree Oil. Got a hair mask. And, oh, they sent me a little, because I didn't order this. Um, what is this? A 10-in-1 hair perfecter. Just a spray, I guess. Adds body, detangles, shine, protects, moisturizes, controls frizz, repairs dry hair, heat protectant, men split ends, and creates silkiness. Okay. And then we have Pro Boost Hair Treatment. 
after shampoo, remove excess, excess water from hair, apply, leave on for five minutes, then rinse. All right. That's what I love about Ulta. I get all kinds of stuff for free and I never even order it. Now this is something that I got from Maybelline. I, this was free because I ordered something and it has um, this cute little bag. We have an eyeliner. Let's see, what do we have in here? We have the liquid eyeliner, falsies, lash lift, lasting fix spray, and my cellular water. So I'll give that a try. Hey, hon. Yeah. Uh, timer's going off. Okay, that's not going back in there, so we just put that over there. And then I got... Should I turn it off? Taste it. And see if it's done. And then I got two Maybelline Superstay inks. I got this one in Lava. And this one in Globetrotter. Let me see. Lava. Oh. oh, they smell good. Oh, pinky shade. Globe chata. Oh, that's a pretty shade, too. I like both of those. It's like a terracotta. Let's see what else I got. Volume Boost Roof Lift. Root Lifter. I guess you just spray this on your roots. It's a spray foam. Instant Lift and Volume. Sometimes I just need that sometimes just right here. That's all I need it for. Oh, and this is a pre-shampoo treatment oil. This is just like a little sample. Restores hair color and protects hair color. Okay. So that must be a little sample that I got with it. And I got hyaluronic acid and lysinamide because oh, because they were on sale. Now, I, they're good molecules. Now, at first, when I first tried good molecules, a few, oh, about, about a year ago, it was not, it, it tore my face up. And I realized what it was. It was the facial cleanser because I got the facial cleanser and I tried it again and it did not do well. So the hyaluronic acid and the niacinamide does very well for my face, but the cleanser does not. Then I also got from NYX, I got a sea, sea foam green and a moss. In eyeliners. If you don't know on this channel, I love green. I love green shadows. Um, I don't taste any salt at all. Okay, I gotta taste his soup, okay? Um, the thing of it is, though, is here lately, I don't really have any kind of taste buds. Uh, well, I, it, things just taste so different to me. Should I take the bay leaves out? Oh, yes. Mm 
I taste no salt and I taste no beef flavor. But that's just me, so you I can't. Didn't, I didn't taste salt. But I taste that it does kind of taste good, but it tastes flat. I'll add some salt and pepper. This one here is seafoam green. Ooh, I like that shade. Ooh, I like this one too. Moss, I really like that also. Okay, now I did get from Maybelline, this is what I got from Maybelline, is some, um, I've been looking for some cream eyeshadows. So from Maybelline, I got some purple and I think a white. But I've been looking for, and I don't know why it's so hard to find, just a single matte and a single shimmer white just white i don't want no reflect no anything i just want white that's it just wait but this is the color tattoo and i got this one in chill girl it's a white it's got a like a, a little shimmer to it but I just want a powder. And I used to use Maybelline or CoverGirl all the time, and now I can't find either one. Ooh. This is Knockout. So here's Knockout, which is kind of like an eggplant. Knockout and Chill Girl. And I love using purple and green together, purple and orange. Yeah. And then here is another brush, another Real Techniques. And this is um, like you can do foundation, primers, moisturizer. Which right now what I do have on my skin is all my skincare and I do have a primer on. And you see this, it's got, you can kind of go in, all that does feel really soft. That does feel very soft. And went in with, um, this is the Milani cream contour and this is in ginger thought i would give this a try i wanted to try the flower beauty one but it was my shade was um out of stock and also the what was it tart that one was out of stock and i have the mario whichever this is spray Got this, it was like $5. And someone told me to try this powder, J-Cat. They said this try to, to try this powder. So I'm going to try this powder. It was only like $6, but one good thing about Ulta is I can exchange, I can always return any of this if I don't like it. And that's my haul. So... That was quite a ball of stuff. So I am going to get off here and put some of this stuff together, take it out of its box, put it away, and then I'm going to do a video and we are going to do nothing but makeup that I got from the Dollar Tree. So we're going to see how that compares with some of the more expensive stuff. So 
Stay beautiful, stay blessed, and stay tuned for my next video. Love ya.